I have an exciting insect and amber to share with you guys. While going through my latest batch of insect fossils from the Dominican Republic, I stumbled upon a truly unique ant. This is a species of ant with jaws that are way longer than usual. And as a bonus, you can see there's a little gnat uh, right above the ant. The ant is really well preserved in the amber and its long jaws are like striking. The details of its exoskeleton and its jaws are something that I've never seen before. It's like this ant was designed to go after the bad guys. The discovery is valuable because it provides evidence of a possible new species of ant that lived in the past. The length of its jaws is a physical adaptation that was likely crucial to it and its hive's survival. So it could mean that the ant was specialized in eating a certain type of food, or that it had to defend itself and its colony against larger predators. Now under the microscope you can see that its jaws are really, really long and sharp and they look deadly. Additionally, this fossil is just fascinating because it's a really good example of diversity that existed in the past. It shows us that even ants, which we often think of as small and unremarkable insects, can have unique adaptations and features that make them stand out. I feel like having that this ant with long jaws is going to be a hit because it's really interesting to researchers. And once again, there's our little gnat. Um, in fact, I wouldn't be surprised if it comes the talk of the uh, antique world. Haha, <laughs> this is truly a unique and special find, and I'm excited to see what further study we can get from this. So, if you like this stuff, follow for more, and feel free to check the link in my bio. If you like this stuff, if you waited this far, the link in my bio has my site, and there are pieces available on my site. Thanks.